Tonight, concern over the first cases of coronavirus in the St. Lucie County Jail. WPTV Treasure Coast reporter John Shaman explains why the sheriff says the virus was likely brought in from the outside. Sheriff Ken Mascara says two inmates at the jail were infected, as was a food service worker. Health officials said it was likely the Aramark Food Service employee was asymptomatic when they came into contact with the inmates at the jail. The sheriff says they received the positive test results over the weekend. In fact, the entire dormitory that housed the exposed inmates have been placed on a lockdown quarantine to ensure that no other inmates display symptoms or come in contact with others in the jail. The St. Lucie County Jail has been implementing the CDC guidance for months to prevent COVID from entering the facility. Three inmates are awaiting test results and a total of five inmates, more than a dozen sheriff's office employees and two Aramark workers are currently in quarantine. No one has been hospitalized. The sheriff is now restricting kitchen access to necessary staff and there's talk of possibly moving the jail kitchen off campus. The sheriff wanted to assure those in the community with loved ones in the jail that they are doing their best possible job to keep their loved ones safe. In St. Lucie County, John Shane, WPTV News Channel 5.